Sturdy. You better ask around and see if anyone knows how to break a magic barrier.
one believes, but I saw it. A strange light was floating over the lake. Maybe it'll appear tonight, too. That light! Monster? Finally! Something's happening in this town! Maybe that light will give me.
I'm a soldier from Valsena. The name's Duran. I saw the light from the inn in Astoria. I see. Oh, I have no other option. So I suppose you'll do. Hold on. What? Oh, never mind. I'll tell you later. Please. I need you to take me to the Priest of Light and Wendell. I can't fly any further on my own. I mean, that's where I'm headed too, but there's a barrier around the cavern. We're stuck here until further notice. Sorry. I can get us through the barrier, but we need to hurry. Something has happened to the Sanctuary of Mana. The Sanctuary of Mana? Wait. Whoa! What was that? It came from Astoria. I gotta go back. Oh, we need to get going. Let me rest inside you for a bit. You won't see me, but don't worry. I'm still here. Whoa, 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 whoa wait, wait, what? Don't delay. We must see to Astoria. Ah, she's talking in my head. Oh, uh, that's so weird. Hurry! Jeez, fine, on it! So, why are you heading to Wendell? I need to get stronger. That's why I gotta find a way to switch classes. I see you haven't had an easy time yourself. everyone this looks like the work of beastmen those cowards there is no time to waste we have to get to the priest of light as soon as possible oh, Wendell is in danger
barrier were in the way, I swear I'd be in Wendell by now. <laughs> it's not fair. Oh, how about that? Uh, you say a fairy's gonna help us get inside? Oh, you must mean the light from the forest. <laughs> I am so glad she's your problem and not mine. <laughs> wow, no thank you. So, is she gonna let us in or what? Oh, and you can help me get to Wendell, by the way. I could use a break. In Altena, the kingdom of magicians, the true queen's magic was all that kept the freezing temperatures of the surrounding snowy lands at bay. But as the mana of the world grew weaker, so did her power. Bit by bit, the ice and cold began to encroach on the castle. Citizens, we all feel the magic draining from the land as mana weakens. For our mighty kingdom of Altena, this is of grave concern. We shall not sit idly while our country crumbles. No, no, we must open the forbidden portal to the sanctuary of mana, and then we can obtain the Sword of Mana. I thought that we tried to manage Be still. Legend says the portal to the Sanctuary of Mana only appears after activating the Mana Stones throughout the world. Obviously, no country would willingly give up a precious Mana Stone, so we expect a certain amount of resistance. We shall muster our strength and take the Mana Stones by force. Our true queen will obtain the Sword of Mana to rule her magic empire. Long live the true queen! Glory to Altena! Oh, come on, Jose! Hush! No need to shout, your highness. Honestly, you know, I used to be the sharpest of the great magic users in the Altanis court. <sighs> whoa, 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 hang on. I do not need another trip down your winding memory lane. Just teach me the rest of yesterday's lesson. I've told you time and time again. You cannot use magic simply by learning the steps. Your magic has not manifested because you rely on form instead of spirit. Oh, please, not another lecture. Fine, I just won't ask for lessons anymore then. Take that. Oh, this child. Look, there's Victor. Hey, Victor, hey! Oh, uh, morning, your highness. Have you finished your magic lessons already? You know, Jose complains to me whenever you skip lessons, right? Please consider my plight next time, Your Highness. Angela, princess and heir to the throne of Altena. With a heavy burden dogging her steps, Angela grew up fatherless in the shadow of her mother's royal duties. Her childhood was extremely lonely. Instead of affection from her mother, it seemed all she received were scoldings. 
Though she knew that the queen had important responsibilities that kept the two from playing, that knowledge didn't stop Angela's frustrated tears. Starved for attention, the princess grew into a rebellious youth. She often acted out, playing pranks on members of the court. Though Angela became a renowned beauty, much like her mother, she remained woefully unable to wield the magic power of her bloodline. That lack of talent was never far from her mind. Ugh, I am so bored. Why does nothing ever happen around here? is training the mages harder than ever. I heard some were injured, but I suppose that's one of the dangers of war. I'm not sure, but the Crimson Wizard might be as powerful as Her Majesty the Queen now. Oh, there you are! Your Highness, the Queen and her advisor have called for you. I will wait for you in the gardens. Now is not the time to dawdle. Please hurry, your highness. This is urgent. Her Majesty is preparing our troops to invade Valsena across the sea. We must go to her, Your Highness. Your Majesty, I believe you sent for me. Angela, allow me to explain. 
As you know, we must control the Mana Stones to gain access to the Sanctuary. That is the reason for our... invasion. Legend says if we activate the energy of the Mana Stones in the world, the portal will open. And we don't question legend. We shall begin with the Altenish Mana Stone. Uh, how will you do that? We will use a forbidden magic spell, outlawed because it takes the life of the Enchanter in exchange for that mana energy. However, my associate and I are too important for this sacrifice. If we use your body as a vessel for that cursed magic, your death would act as the catalyst we need to release the Mana Stone's true power. But, 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 Mother! You've been a useless blight on my lineage for far too long. To think that my daughter could be so weak and powerless. Under these circumstances, sacrificing yourself for the spell is the most fitting end for my heir. Now come, my child. N n no She's gone! Hmm... Where? I'm outside the castle. But... Why? Why would my mother... I can't return. I can't return, but I have no idea what to do now. Wasn't there a village to the east? That might be my only option at this point. Thank you. 
Oh, good, you're awake. My daughter found you in the snowfields. Hmm? We brought you back to Ulrent. Please rest until you feel well. Cheery, look! Our guest woke up! <laughs> Yay! Can I play with her? Huh? Can I? No, don't bother her. But I'll play with you. guidance hmm. sometimes people lose any last spark of hope and fall into the deepest despair <laughs> when that happens you must go to holy city Wendell and seek advice from his eminence the priest of light the priest of light to find your way through the darkness of despair you will need a guiding light. Go to Wendell, child. That is your fate. Huh? Come on! This fraud told me the same thing. <coughs> Go to Wendell or whatever. All I asked was whether my next child was going to be a boy or a girl. City Wendell, huh? I don't know what awaits me there, but I guess it's bound to be better than getting caught here in my own kingdom. I'll go. I mean, nothing could possibly be worse than staying cooped up in the castle. And if there's a chance, at least. Heavy with the Queen's rejection, Angela left Altena as a wanted criminal with a price on her head. Wait a sec. You said you're the Princess of Altena. Then you must be friends with that blasted wizard, huh? Excuse me? Don't even joke about that. That guy conspired with my mom to sacrifice my life in exchange for magic. Ugh, I hate that jerk. Oh, sorry. I didn't realize. Then what's up with that wizard anyway? I mean, who is he? It's complicated. Years back, he couldn't use magic either, like me. Our teacher, Jose, was at his wit's end. But then suddenly, he was able to wield incredible power. Now the Crimson Wizard acts as the Queen's chief advisor. And to top it off, he doesn't even call me by my royal title. Can you believe that? Ooh, it makes me so mad. Incredibly powerful wizard, huh? 
Well, I'm gonna be the best swordsman in Valsena. He won't stand a chance. <laughs> oh, how silly of me. I never asked your name. Duran, huh? All right then. Lead on, Duran. Get rid of the barrier. There, you should be fine now. On your own out here. Well, as the princess of Altena, I've had training. I'll take monsters over the Altanish forces any day. In that case, I won't worry if we find some trouble out there. You can come with, but um, don't get in the way of my training. Got it? Next. <laughs>
Ghana, but you saved me! <laughs> <clears throat> I'm Charlotte. I'm a famous beauty from Wendell. Hey, beauty or not, stay away from legends, okay? It's dangerous. Are you okay? Huh? You sure? You ran up so quickly, I was afraid I'd hurt you. <laughs> Looks like you're okay, though. Your Eminence, may I have a word about Charlotte? Oh, Heath, Manor's blessings be with you. How is my granddaughter? She isn't as chipper as usual. She seems young thanks to her elfin heritage, but she is 15. She may have sensed the shift in mana power. I see. Look here, Heath. The manor statue has begun to cry, and you saw the light above the lake last night. Yes, sir. It was bright as day in the middle of the night. Do you know the source? I do not. But I believe it has to do with a change in the mana power of the world. The lights seem to land in Astoria, across the lake. Would you be willing to look into it, Heath? Of course, Your Eminence. I believe there is trouble in Jad as well. We should erect a barrier in Cascade Cavern to protect Wendell from any interlopers with bad intent. It would be the safest plan. Dangerous. I can't let Heath face it alone. I gotta go after him. Okie dokie. Let's get out of here. Ah uh ah. -uh. Come now, Charlotte. You're not supposed to leave the temple today. Let me go! I gotta save Heath! What a 
junk! Let's go a different way. Oh! Hi, Charlotte! Mick, I know you aren't some dumb little kid anymore. Come on, help me get to Estolia. What? Do you want to go to Astoria? But there are monsters in Cascade Cavern and all around the lake. Plus, you don't know magic like the grown-ups. Hey, listen up, Tiny. I may be as small as you are, but I happen to be 15 years old. So I'm basically an adult. My body is just aging slower than most people's do. That's all. Got it? Now tell me how to get to Astoria, or else. Okay, fine! Meet me outside, on the second floor balcony, tonight. I know a secret that might help. Nothing what to do. Let's take a nap. for me to sneak this away without anyone noticing what I was doing. This is a spring stepper. It lets you jump really far. Just don't ask where I took it from, okay? Okay, great. So, how exactly is this supposed to help me? You can jump to Astoria with this without the grown-ups knowing. But you gotta go now. Someone could come by at any second. <laughs> oh no! I think my aim was off. Uh, not my fault. Little girl. Uh. Oh. Now what? <laughs> oh, uh, you're up. Uh, this is. Astoria. You okay? Ooh. I'm sorry. This is Mick's fault. He's toast when I get back. Uh, I'll go. You stay. It's night, so sleep, okay? a nice person last night. But I've wasted enough time. Gotta find Heath.
Where did you go? think you're doing? I could ask the same of you. What business could Ferolian guards possibly have in this place? Hey, this human's a priest from Wendell. We can't let him go now that he's seen us. It could jeopardize our beast man invasion. Invasion? Impossible! What's with this kid? What's with you? Ow! 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 Let me go, you big old... Shirley! Leave the child alone! Ow! Don't worry, Charlotte. I took care of them. What are you doing here? Something is coming. No! No! Make it stop! Uh, watch out! Ah! Uh. <gasps> <laughs> wow! Didn't realize that holy bolt would work so well. I suppose it is a powerful spell after all. Ooh, looks like I hooked a whopper! No! Oh no! What did you do to Heath? Huh? Oh, silly child! Run if you know what's good for you! <laughs>
was whisked away by the mysterious man as the Beastmen began to attack the city of Jad. Alone and frightened, Charlotte heard a noise nearby. to see the Priest of Light anyway. You could come west, but don't get comfy. Come on. Oh, you want to see Grandpa? Why didn't you say so? You didn't know it, but you helped your chances. I'm actually the granddaughter of the Priest of Light. Come on, Swellpoke. I'll take you to my Grandpa. Now, it's off to Wendell! Oh, great. Wendell is straight ahead! Come along, recruits! Follow me! Great. She's a comedian. Find that priest of light. Thank you so much for taking me here. Hurry, we need to request an audience with his eminence. Hmm. 
I think I'll wait out here. I left without telling Grandpa. He's probably really mad at me. Accept the Goddess of Manor's blessings. You're the Priest of Light, right? Tell me how to change my class. I need to be stronger now! Please. Impossible. There is no way you could switch classes right now. You lack the experience necessary for such a feat. What? But... I... You must have at least heard tell of the Mana Stones, correct? First, you must gain enough experience through battle, then call upon a Mana Stone's power to switch to another class. Who's got time for that? Your Eminence, if I don't get stronger, I can't give that crimson jerk what's coming to him! So, you're the Priest of Light, hmm? Huh? You're... Plainer than I expected. I was hoping you might have some wisdom to share. Whoa. Wait! I have something to say. Your evidence. Please listen. I have come from the Sanctuary of Mana to tell you that the mana tree is withering. Mana power grows weaker by the day. Withering? But without the mana tree, the seals on the mana stones will break. The Benevidons will be released into the world. The Benevid... what? What's that? You're acting like this doesn't affect you. You've been chosen by Fairy. This means that you alone can retrieve the Sword of Mana from the Sanctuary. I've been... what? She didn't mention that. Hey, Fairy? What gives? I'm sorry. With the mana in the world so depleted, a fairy can't leave the sanctuary for long without a host. If I hadn't found you, I wouldn't have made it. Yeah, okay. That's good for you and all, but no thanks. I don't need the stress in my life. Go haunt that old man instead. Would that I were able to bear your burden. However, once a fairy finds a host, they are bound to them for their whole life. Only death can part them. Wait one second. I never agreed to this. I don't need a sort of mana or whatever. You want to defeat the Crimson Wizard, correct? With the Sword of Mana, you'll be the strongest swordsman in all the world! Hey! Stop sneaking around in my mind! But, uh... <clears throat> what is the Sword of Mana anyway? The Sword of Mana is the embodiment of the ancient power of mana, guiding force of spirit. It is an alternate form of the Golden Wand used to create the world itself. The one who holds the Mana Sword gains awesome power. The sword lies in the roots of the Mana Tree, waiting. Before the Mana Tree withers completely, must reclaim the sword and awaken the goddess of mana once more. She alone can bring peace to the realm 
and grant your wish. So, if I get that sword, I can defeat the Crimson Wizard! Where can I find the Sanctuary of Mana? And how do I get there? I am so sorry. But with mana so depleted, I don't have enough power to open the portal to the Sanctuary. Not by myself. Throughout the world are eight points of mana energy. Mana stones, sealing away the fearsome Benevidons. If you activate the mana stones, the portal connecting our world to the Sanctuary of Mana should appear. Through that portal is the Sanctuary. However, you should know that the energy inside the eight mana stones was sealed on purpose as the mana goddess began her slumber. So, what should I do? In ages past, there once was an ancient spell used to control the energy from the mana stones and bend it to the user's will. However, countries refused to allow each other any control of the spell and use of the mana stones. The war that followed caused unspeakable damage. It was nearly as destructive as the sealed Benevidons. The survivors cursed the magic to avoid future tragedy and forbade anyone from using it. Now the life of any person who uses the spell will be forfeit. There is no longer anyone alive who knows how to work this cursed spell. Guess that's it. There may be one way. If we borrow the powers of the elemental spirits that reside near the mana stones instead, I can combine their powers with what remains of mine to open the portal for everyone! Splendid! This is a relief. If you wish to find a mana stone, I've heard many say that the light stone is in Cascade Cavern, guarded by the elemental Lumina. It is the cavern you pass through in order to reach here. Take Fairy. With what remains of her power, she can help you find Lumina in the cavern. See if you may borrow his light powers. So, wait. The Sword of Mana? Huh. I think my mother mentioned that thing. But if I can get it before her... I can show her that I'm not powerless. She might even let me come back. Hey, take me with you. Please, come on. Certainly. And the more elementals we meet, the more magic you can learn yourself. Really? That's perfect.
take it out. The fort does more damage. <laughs> <laughs> Closer to becoming the strongest swordsman in the world. Give it to me, Wookiee! And with that, peace has returned! That's what I call power! 